Hi, I'm Nancy Berliner with HPE Technical Marketing Engineering. HPE Primera Storage Systems can now be managed in the cloud with HPE Data Services Cloud Console, or DSCC. This video will show you how you can get up and running with cloud management in only a few minutes. All HPE Primera Systems come with an all-inclusive software license and management with DSCC is included at no additional charge. You have the option of using DSCC along with your current on-prem tools or transitioning primarily to cloud management. The only requirements are Primera OS 4.4 or greater, a valid support contract, connection to HPE InfoSight, port 443 in your file roll opened for outbound communication, and an IPv4 management address. The only caveat is that unlike HPE Electra storage, Primera doesn't come from the factory with a certificate that's needed to authenticate to DSCC. But the process to get a certificate and onboard to DSCC is really simple, as you'll see in the demo. Here I am at the dashboard of the Primera onboard UI. Once you upgrade to OS 4.4, the option for Data Services Cloud Console appears in Settings Telemetry. DSCC is still disabled, however, so the first step is to toggle it on. That triggers the array to request a certificate and its associated subscription key from HPE InfoSight. DSCC is now enabled, but you're not yet connected because you still need to onboard your device. You'll need two pieces of information, both of which are available right here, the system serial number and the subscription key. I'll copy the key to my PC's clipboard and then head over to HPE GreenLight. If this is the first time you're using GreenLake, you'll need to create a company and user account and add the DSCC application. There are getting started videos right on the home screen that walk you through that process, so I don't need to cover it here. I'll just go straight to the device management section and add my device. HPE GreenLake can manage network and compute devices in addition to storage. Since I have a storage device, I'll paste in the system serial number and the subscription key I copied from the onboard UI. The pop-up says it will take a while to see the device, but in my experience, it's been pretty fast. My system already appears in the list. HPE GreenLake has multiple applications associated with it. So the next step is to assign the system to the DSCC application. There are instances of DSCC around the world, and you will have already associated your company account with the one or ones that are physically closest to your storage. My array is in California, so for me, it's DSCC US1. And now I'm all set. My Primera system has been onboarded and is visible in Data Ops Manager. I can now start managing my storage with DSCC and take advantage of the features unique to our cloud management tools. Back at the onboard Primera UI, there's a new DSCC icon on the dashboard with a green check mark indicating successful connectivity to HPE GreenLake. It took me no more than a few minutes to get up and running with cloud management. Thanks for watching. For more information on the HPE Cloud experience, visit hpe.com/storage.